everyone! I'm Coach Moy. I'm your race director. Today, I'll be showing you tips and techniques on how to do the obstacles safely and efficiently. Be limitless! Let's go! Here with us is one of the Philippines' top national OCR athletes, Coach Sherwin. He will be demonstrating the most efficient ways to execute some of the obstacles we prepared for you. Let's start with the rings. Out of the many ways to get you through this course, I'll be showing three efficient ways to do it. Beginner, intermediate, and advanced. For beginners, we'll do the matching technique. Grab the first ring with your non-dominant hand and reach the second ring with your dominant hand. Then match it with your non-dominant hand and simply repeat the process. For intermediate, start with your non-dominant hand and then reach the second ring with your dominant hand. Then skip rings as you traverse. And for the advance, make sure that you reach with your hands face forward as you move to the rings. This requires strong grip and mobile shoulders. Next up, monkey bars. I have two options for you, beginners and advanced. For beginners, reach the first bar with both hands, then move to the second bar with your dominant hand followed by the other. Continue the process using your dominant hand as you move forward. For advanced, you can do the monkey swing to complete the obstacle. Now let's do burpees. Squat down with both hands on the ground, kick your legs out to the back, chest on the ground, push up, kick your feet into a small position, stand up, and jump. And this is how you do it on a continuous motion. Welcome to the balance beam. All you need to do is walk through the beam from point A to point B, maintaining a good balance. Let's move on to step up over. Step on the box and step down to the other side. Simply turn around and do the process once again. Make sure to stand up straight while you're on the box. Let's move over to Atlas Carry. Put one knee on the ground close to the Atlas Stone. Roll the stone up to your thigh. Hug and shift it to the other leg. Once here, stand up slowly and move from point A to point B. At the end of the course, squat down and drop the stone carefully. Here we are with a plate pinch carry. Simply grab the plates by its circumference and not at the inner hole. Lift both plates on the side of your body without bending your arms and keep the arm fully extended while moving from point A to point B. Let me walk you through with the plate carry overhead. Grab the plates to your chest, bring them over your head, make sure not to bend your arms. Keep the arm fully extended while moving from point A to point B. Next is sandbag carry. Take note, this is just a representation of the actual sandbag and this is how it looks like during the event. Squat down, hide the sandbag and stand up slowly and move forward. You may up to put it on your shoulder and continue to point B. Let me show you the jerry can carry. This is just a representation of the actual jerry can and this is how it looks like during the event. Squat down and hold the handles and slowly lift them off the ground. Walk from point A to point B. Kettlebell ground to overhead. Squat down, lift the kettlebell up to your chest, press it up over your head, back to your chest, squat down and put it back to the ground. And this is how it looks like on a continuous motion. Remember to keep your back straight at all times. Last but not least, tire flip. Squat down, lift the tire by standing up. Use your leg to add momentum to flip it over. Remember to keep your back straight at all times. Ang saya! That's why just follow the tips and all the techniques that will guide you to the event. Be, Be limitless. limitless! Good luck!